Hi Pokey Babes, it's Shania Satisfaction here and I'm bringing you another Sassy Saturdays with me, Shania Satisfaction, right here on my channel on YouTube and simulcasting on Now Trending app. Hope you guys are doing good. I hope you have missed me because I have missed all of you. Things have been crazy. I have been working um, as soon as you, some of you may know. So I work at Morphe here in San Diego. So um, we've been hitting the ground running um, since July 2nd. So um, I'm trying my best to get videos out to you guys. I super duper promise, but I have um, Money Zora Drag and stuff that, that I have been filming for, but I haven't really figured out a good formula for filming and everything, but I promise you I will. So I'm going to get right into it today, you guys. Please make sure you subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed today's video. This is going to be a lot of fun. I am dressed in the theme of Pikachu, obviously, because today we're going to be getting in to this Pikachu EVGX box. Yay! So, of course, I had to go with the theme. Um, I definitely left out Eevee, um, but I didn't mean to. I have Pikachu here. I don't know if y'all can see her, but there's my little Eevee. And Pikachu's a little grumpy. Um, but, headache medicine. I got this from Walmart, so I've been anxious to get into this. It's got some amazing packs in there, so this is going to be a good one. Okay, so. Uh, again, please make sure you share this video to any Pokey friends of yours um, that love Pokemon card openings and a little dash of drag added in. I would love to have them here. Thank you all who have subscribed so far. This has been a lot of fun and I promise to do better. Um, so without further ado, enough of the chit chat, bitch. Let's get into it. So this is the box. You get two special GX cards that are promo cards and you get two hollow foil promos and a gigantic Pikachu promo GX. Um, so we're gonna get into that, but that's not all. Um, before I get into that, I'll also be doing a random Cosmic Eclipse. We got some Unified Minds and a uh, off-brand, and it's not, well, this isn't produced by the Pokemon Company. Well, actually, I think it is, because it's got the Pokemon thing up here. And it's got the online thing. So actually, Pokemon does make these. This is just some surplus plat. Look, surplus packs um, that you can get at I believe Walmart. Um, and I wanted the Mimikyu pin too. So I love base sets on the moon. I love Rebel Clash. This is only like $9.99. So I was like, okay, done deal. Um, so we're gonna get into those right after the box. But first things first. As I set up, as I ruin my set here, because I'm so clumsy and it's like I'm on a date with you guys or something. It's so much. One day I'm gonna get a professional setup, I promise. I just don't know how to do it with the opening of the cards and stuff unless I get like some kind of table. I need a new, um, like this thing is like broken because I'm too rough with stuff, I guess. Okay, moments later, but I hope everyone is doing well. I'm not wearing nails because I have to get into packaging and you don't need that. You don't need nails flying everywhere. Um, so all those cleans up there sticker for nails will bite me. Okay, I'm opening up a bunch of products. It's not easy with nails. So here are all the promo cards. Um, they come with little plastic things behind them, so please make sure that you're careful removing stuff like this. Recycle kids. Alright, so the first card. Let's turn on hand cam. Da, 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 da. Here is the Pikachu with Don Fan and Hop Bib. I love it when they do cards that tell a little story that have more than one. Oh, and there's an unknown way back there in the bag. Really, really cool. Excuse my really bad hands. Um, I need a manicure very, very badly. Here is the Pikachu GX card. Very, very nice. You can only get these cards, I think, with this kind of box. So definitely go and grab you some, or grab you one. Um, they're at Walmart, Target. I've even seen them at Barnes & Noble. So they're around. I love that Eevee card. The, the art is just so funny. 
And there's like another story on here with the Eevee promo with Tyrogue, Chatot, and Rhyhorn. Eevee riding on the back of a Rhyhorn is so freaking cute. I love a full action moment um, with these cars. So that's that. Recycle. Now, here is the big boy. The Jumbo Pikachu GX. Super, super neat. I have been using like an art portfolio um, to keep my Jumbo cards. Let me know if you want to see my Jumbo, co Jumbo card binder at some point. Really, really nice. So I'm going to have Pikachu just hang out back there. He'll be our like little mascot for the day. Now, here's the code card for the box. For all my online players, good luck to whoever gets that. Unified Minds, Cosmic Eclipse, and Evolutions. Really good packs. This is going to be a lot of fun. Please make sure you guys subscribe for more um, amazing openings like this. I hope everyone has been having a great week. Um, mine has been crazy and chill at the same time, so I don't know how really that would work. But, um, yes, just, uh, you know... Things can be crazy sometimes, but you just gotta go with it and make the best of things. Here's the code card for Evolutions. Um, I don't foresee us pulling anything too crazy with this, just because um, it's surplus. And I think I did the card. I did. Sorry, guys. I did the card trick wrong. Predicate is our rare, so ooh. Now we did get a reverse Zapdos rare. I do not have this card at all in the set, so that's pretty awesome. I'll, um, I'll actually go ahead and sleeve it in a moment. Yas, queen! Alright, you guys. So, I got me a sleeve for the Zapdos. Um, but I couldn't find um, a bunch of my other ones. So I'm going to put all my other cards in these um, soft sleeves, so they'll at least be semi-protected. So we're going to put Evolutions to the side. We're going to go right into Cosmic Eclipse, one of my favorite sets personally. I would say Sword and Shield and Cosmic Eclipse got me back into collecting. Um, that's when I started to notice how cool the cards were looking again. Not that any Pokemon card isn't cool. Oh, red and blue. I really want to get the full out of that. Togedemaru, Absol, sorry. Cottony, Rowlet, Phantom, Alolan Grimer, Magnemite, Pan, and an Alolan Sand Slash non-holographic. That is a rare, so that's still a win. All of these, you never lose, okay? It's just a matter of luck of the draw when it comes to Pokemon cards. So, here's the code card. So far we have not struck any gold. Um, and most of the code cards have not been helping us foretell anything. Mawile, Dusclops, I love Dusk Noir, it's one of my favorite ghost types. Pikachu's Stuffle, Reverse Chaotic Swell. And I still got my GX full art. I pulled this recently. Uh, there's thus the regular Silvage. Little I can't even speak. I'm so excited. The regular Silvalli GX I pulled already um, on my Blake channel um, on a video I got coming up. But this is the full art. Amazing. So we're gonna get that soft sleeve just to keep it protected for now. The centering is a little off from left to right, but other than that, amazing card. So far, we got a Zapdos Reverse and a Silval IGX. We're we doing okay. Okay, so this box had some amazing stuff in it. I really enjoyed the promo cards. I'm a promo card lover. Here is Unified Minds. That's kind of a good sign. Code card for whoever gets that. Good luck. And four card trick. Let's see if this is the last pack is going to give us something amazing from this box. Tauros. Tortuga. Tranquil. The Salad. Tynamo. 
Dread again is a common in Unified Minds. Serena, come on, girl. Back, back, back it up. Back, back, back it up. Truck it, truck it. Yes, honey. I love that art. She is serving with that high jump kick. Okay. And a Magnazone holographic. Not too shabby. And it is a rare. Um, I did not have Serena or Magnazone. So that's pretty awesome. Well, the box, the Pikachu and EV box gave us some pretty cool. I mean, the pulls aren't bad. I, I am really excited about that full RGX. Um, that was awesome. So we're going to get right into the next few packs. Um, because sometimes with those boxes, like, I know, like, they're cool and all, but you don't always pull amazingness. And I want to pull some crazy, crazy-ish today. So here's the Cosmic Eclipse. I don't forgot where I found this check lane blister. I can't remember if I ordered it. Here's the code card. Or if I bought it in store. But here's the Mass Magius with a swirl right there. Right over here. I really enjoyed this card art and the hollow foil, very old school. Um, but I'm gonna sleeve that one up too, just because you never know with promo cards. Sometimes they get a spike, and just because people like the card. Uh, and we got a Lucario coin. I've got like way too many of these. So we're gonna push those to the side. Here is the Cosmic Eclipse pack. Excuse me if I knock over that hand cam. There's the code card. All right, you guys, here we go. The single random Cosmic Eclipse pack. Here is a Water Energy, Flareon, Roller Skater, Clefairy, Ponyard, Togedemaru, Trapinch, Flabebe, Tangela, Torkoal, and a Heliolisk Non-Holographic. Well, you never know with blister packs, so before we get into this Unified Minds, please, if you're enjoying today's video, give, this day, give today's video a thumbs up. Um, I really enjoy doing these, so um, I'm happy to um, hear any kind of feedback or anything that you might want to see me open. Um, I'm definitely open to suggestions. But thanks again for joining me today, and we're going to get into these last blister packs. So I'm going to get into this one. Um, this one caught my eye because I think it was like the only one left. It was $9.99. Two great card packs in there. And a pin. And this is not third party. This is um, an actual Pokemon product. <clears throat> and I believe it's just a way to get rid of surplus extra Pokemon goodness. But here is the Mimikyu pin. I don't have him, but now I... Or I didn't have him, but now I do. So I'm really looking forward to um, adding this to the collection. So we can put Mimikyu back here. Then we get two booster packs. So we have the most current right before um, Darkness of Blaze comes out. We have the most current, Rebel Clash. Then we also have Base Set Sun and Moon, which I enjoy both series. So let's get right into it. Um, I hope you guys have been enjoying this today. I know I have. Ooh, good sign. Uh, there is the code card. We're having problems focusing today um lots of shiny goodness so uh let me know if you guys want to see um more box theme videos and openings i am very um interested to know your guys' thoughts on these videos Ooh, a reverse crook cro a dial and a tauros gx very very nice Definitely a card I do not have in my um, Sun and Moon Master Set, so this is awesome. Let's see. Centering is off from top to bottom, I believe. Um, but other than that, an amazing card. Let's go ahead and sleeve Tauros and add him to the awesome pile of cards. And then Rebel Clash with Rillaboom at the front. Um, I hope you guys have... Um, been enjoying Rebel Clash. I know that I have. Um, I'm really excited for Darkness of Blaze, which is the next set for Sword and Shield coming out. 
and I definitely will be opening up some here on this channel and on my Blake channel. Electivire Reverse and an Appleton Hollow. I did not have this yet, so that's awesome. Very excited to add this to the collection. Super, super cute. All right, Appleton. You get a soft sleeve as well. Well, you guys, so far, we have an Appleton Hollow, Taurus GX, Magazone Hollow, Silvalli GX, Full Art, and Reverse Zapdos. We are killing it. All right, you guys, last pack. One of my favorite sets, Unified Minds from Sun and Moon. And we're just going to jump right in because I am ready to get into this. I love Unified Minds. I want the Me Too and Mew GX. Here is the promo card, which I definitely already have. I think I might do a giveaway with a bunch of promo cards. Um, let me go. Let me know if you guys would like some kind of giveaway with all those extra cards that I have. Because um, if I already have the card, it's just sitting in bulk. And I don't want to keep a whole bunch of bulk. I'm not going to play the game. So why not give it to one of my uh, Satisfaction family members. So here is Rowlet. That coin is super cute. Love the pattern. So let's get right into these last packs, you guys. Thanks for joining me today. I hope you're having a lot of fun watching me open up these. I hope this brings back that nostalgia feel as a kid of opening up cards. So we got four cards to the front. And here we go, you guys. Fighting Energy, Yon Mega, Your Ringing Bell, Blaine's Quiz Show, Shroomish, Slack Off, Drifloon, Dupider, Dreadigan, Reverse Bound Sweep, and a Galvantula uh, Holographic. Um, I'm going to kind of just breeze through these because I've already opened up Unified. Any of these um, that I just fly through, it's because I've already um, opened up a lot of them. So, unless it's like a card that I haven't gotten or I just enjoy the artwork, well, I haven't gotten that. Um, that's when I'll slow down. Um, I'm trying not to go too fast so you can still at least see the card art. Ooh, I like that Onyx, actually. Um, but not super slow, either. Scrafty, Necrozma. Because, you know, everyone's busy. I don't want to take your full day. But I just want to, um, you know, still get through this quickly. But also enough time for everyone to enjoy the Pokemon card game. Last four cards to the front. Here we go, you guys. Fire Energy. Barangaroo. Weakness Guard Energy. Stadium Nav. Cottony, Fomantis, Sawaddle, Marini, Litwick, Reverse Young Goose, and a non holographic Araquanid. Well, sometimes the blister packs are good and some of them are not. It was a, um, a random, those were random blister packs I saw at Walmart um, when I was getting this box. So I was like, might as well grab them because Unified Minds is getting harder to find. So it's Cosmic Eclipse, even though that was such a huge print or had a, such a huge print run, but it's starting to become older. So get your hands on any of these products if you enjoyed them. You can get them online, Walmart, your card, local card shops. Definitely support mom and pop card shops if you can. TCG Player, a lot, a lot of the products there come from mom, mom and pop shops. So definitely check that site out. That's where I get a lot of stuff. But thank you guys so much for joining me today. I hope you had a great time. Thank you now for tuning out for simulcasting my videos. Thanks for joining my YouTube channel. Um, if you guys haven't subscribed by now, definitely go do that. Click that notification bell so you get notified when Shania uploads more videos, honey. But before I go, I want you to guys to um, meet Professor Pussy Willow. She's going to be giving you some information on Pikachu and then you are free to go. So definitely stick around um, for Professor Pussy Willow's, uh, Professor Pussy Willow's Pokemon Minute. That's a mouthful. I'm going to have to change that. But she's here to give you some info on Pikachu and I hope you have a great day, you guys. And I'll see you next week for Sassy Saturdays with me, Shania Satisfaction. Well, hello. My name is Professor Pussy Willow. That's right. I am a professor of Pokemon and I would like to talk to you about these furry, fun, energetic, and powerful creatures that we share this planet Earth with. So you want to start a journey? Well, I've got a few things that you need to know. 
Why don't we start with the most popular Pokemon of all, Pikachu. That's right, that chubby, friendly, lovable little rodent that everyone loves. Well, here's a few things that you need to know. In order to get a Pikachu, if you can't find one in the wild, you have to evolve a Pichu on a high friendship level. That means you and that little rodent have to become best friends. <laughs> so it's quite easy. All you have to do is just show it extra love and care. Make sure that you take care of it right after battles. Make sure that you spend lots of time giving it nice rubs and lots of berries. Most Pikachu live in groups in the forest areas. So they like to live in packs and in families just like all of us love to do. In Alola, the Alolan region, Pikachus like to introduce themselves by sniffing and rubbing tails together to spark electricity. Pikachus keep their electricity in their electrical sacks and those little red chubby cheeks of theirs. That's where they store all of their excess energy. And while they're sleeping overnight, that's when they recharge basically their batteries. If there's too much energy built up in its little chubby cheeks, it will discharge the excess energy when at will. So you have to be careful not to get shot. Now it has also been known that Pikachu has a Gigantamax evolution form. So if you are in the Galar region, you may have already noticed that your Pikachu can Gigantamax evolve. Which means it can basically stay as a Pikachu, not as a Raichu or a Pichu, but as Pikachu. It can get into a Gigantamax form and be gigantic. Huge tail, lots of excess energy and power. This is an amazing feat by that little electrical friendly rodent that we all tend to love. Wow, it can really pack a punch. I really hope you guys have enjoyed a little bit of information shed on one of your favorite Pokemon. Again, my name is Professor Pussy Willow and I will see you again for another Professor Pikachu! Oh, would you look at that? I think somebody just brought in a Pikachu and I need to go help them. So, my name is Professor Pussy Willow and I'll see you guys right here on Sassy Saturdays yet again for our Professor Pokemon Minute. Bye guys. Oh, yes, I'll be right there. It doesn't like Pokeballs. Bye babies.